You're our leader. I'm trusting you to protect all of us. Se os vermes brilharem muito, eles vão acordar, ok. Então tem que ser bem devagar. O que aconteceu? Rocket. Hey, Rocket. Wake up. I asked for to go container. Okay. We're gonna get you out of here. Almost there. Oh yeah. Crap. Hey. You all right, Rocket? Uh, uh, I feel like I just boozed for a week, and took a header into Drax's fist. What happened? How'd you end up in... the... What, in a giant alien lunch sack? Never would have happened if you'd come with me.
Everyone stay quiet. I'll get tracks. Wakey, wakey, big guy. Time to get up before the worms do. Devagar, devagar, pra não dar merda. Saying something. Yeah. Yeah. Missed you too, man. Okay, Drax. That's enough awkward hugging for today. <laughs> Seriously, Drax, get off me. I will help you. No, no, not you, Mantis. No. Memoria do Drax ou do Peter? filhinho dele I got you papa You should have seen your face Outwitted by your own daughter É filha You surprised me I knew I could do it You are getting stealthier You have now completed the test of guile and diversion These skills will serve you well on the warrior's path where every child must leave their home and make the perilous journey to the training grounds. Take it seriously, Kamaria. I say it out of love, daughter. This path, it is not to be taken lightly. If... If I was scared, that would be all right, wouldn't it? Not that I am. It's just that... I mean, I suppose many who seek the warrior's path might have such feelings. It is normal to feel scared. It is? Yes. So use it to make yourself more focused and less reckless in battle. I must admit, I do feel a little scared, but I will be stronger for it. We don't have long. Before you leave, I promised you. The tattoo! I am ready, Papa. <laughs> I know you are. Your first tattoo marks you as a warrior in training. You will add many as your journey continues. Relax, daughter. It will not take long. Kylos, your mother and I had our soul union there. I don't ever want a soul union. Never. Ever. I will become a great warrior on my own. I'm not like the other scouts. Talking as if they're already warriors. They are far too childish for me. 
You do not have to participate in a soul union if you do not wish to. It is your decision to make. And yours alone. Good. <clears throat> you are doing very well. I remember my first. And how much it hurt. Papa, there's so little time. And sometimes I feel like there's still so much to ask you. What is it you wish to know? What if... What if I face an opponent who cannot be beaten? I am strong, but I am small. I fear that my skills will not be enough when the time comes. Then you run. And live to fight another day. Great warriors always use their minds. Like I do. Yes. I will be cautious. And what if... <clears throat> what will you do if I return more powerful than even you? My legend spreading across the valleys. My foes quivering in fear. And I will be more proud than my simple words can express. It is done. It is us. There is one last test you must pass before you can leave. Conquering the unknown. It's too far. I, I can't see what's down there. You must jump. Unless you wish to wait another year. No! I'm ready! Like you said. It's normal to feel scared. I... I can't do it. You have to help me, Papa. Wait! I get to spend another season with you, even though I let you down. That is not possible. I am proud of you no matter what you do. Thank you, Papa. I will be stronger for you. Papa, we should go home now. You have to let me go sometime. I want to leave this place of my shame. You can't hold on to me forever. I get it. You're gonna miss me when I'm gone. Esses flashbacks todos, o do Peter Quill dela e o do Drax foram os que mais mexeram comigo, com certeza. I never should have let her go. Maybe, maybe then she would still be alive. Drax, I... Hey, that's real sad and all, but we can use some muscle over here. Hum, achou que a mamãe chegou, hein? Caramba, olha o tamanho! This is where we run. Hey, 
hours on you before. I didn't mean to. It wasn't intentional. I was only trying to pull him off you. Now really isn't the time for this. Then I will be fast. I'm sorry. I promised I wouldn't make you relive someone else's memory without your permission. <laughs> okay, we can go. The ship! There's my girl! Hurry, Rocket! I'm trying! I ain't got long stick legs like the rest of you! Everyone take a seat, we're leaving! Did any of you get a good look at that thing? <laughs> what was that even? I am Groot. A tree? Stop yanking my tail! I am Groot. It's giant and terrifying and probably wants us dead. I don't need to know any more about it. In this case, I'll say your extreme lack of curiosity is a virtue, Will. Nebula's plugged into the ship. She's stable. Okay, then we're good to go. Something. Someone is starving. No, bigger. My hunger has no equal. Ah, once we're out of here, we'll get you some food. This one big boat. I am Groot. Wrong again, Groot. We're all gonna die. Punch it, Pete! Not today! Eles estão no estômago da criatura. Are we dead? Not quite. We're lunch or dinner. Jonas e a baleia. Olha aí. The slimy cave. It is a big old stomach. Nebula. Look at her. What the hell is she doing? Mora, wait. Jonas e a baleia, olha aí. Damn it. Plug her back in, Peter. No. Stop. Please. If your systems shut down, we can power them through the ship. It won't do anything. Stop being so stubborn. It can help keep you alive. I don't like being tethered. No. I'm past that point. Don't be stupid, please. Don't make me beg. It's okay, Gamora. Let's leave her be. Pick it back up. She'll let me have this. Thanks, Quill. Well, I'm not ready to give up on you. I'm going to get Rocket. There's no use. Can't be put back together. This time. Honestly, it feels good to have parts of me. Thank you for helping us back there. You risked yourself for all of us. And look where it got me. At least Gamora's okay. It was my idea to put all this in my body. Told everyone it was so I could be better than Gamora. Why did you really do it? To be more like her. I 
looked up to her. I was terrible to her. I nearly killed her. I loved her. You should tell her exactly how you feel. You have no idea how happy that would make her. You think so? I can't. I can't. And after everything that happened, it's too late for Gabor and me. I'm a living reminder of our time with Thanos. She can't move on until that last. The last piece of it was gone. <laughs> Things will be better soon. <laughs> For everyone. Look, this might sound corny, but it's never too late to make things right. You can always make a change. Yeah. Maybe you're right. Thank you, Peter, for listening to us. <laughs> Whatever it is, I'll tell her what you said. I've been afraid of how she might react for so long, but I'm already dying. <laughs> What's the worst that could happen? Hey. Hey. Do, uh, do you want me to... I don't know people uh, trying to fix me. I, uh, yeah, I get that. There's something I need to tell you, sister. What is it? Que episódio intenso esse. Nossa, muito intenso. I can sense your despair, Peter. Everyone's really. Is Nebula still? I don't mean to pile it on, but I got some bad news too. Our engines got thrashed when we were swallowed. Can we still fly this thing? Not a friggin' chance. Okay. Let's get back to work. Mora, you don't need to be here right now. We understand. This is better for me. I want to help. In the end, she was one of us. A guardian. I think she liked it. Being part of something good for once. Nebula was the fiercest, 
most sinister opponent I have faced in battle. What I liked most about Neb was how much she hated Pete. Like in a deep, unrelenting way. Funny girl. I am Groot. Oh yeah, and she really seemed to care about you, Gamor. You should value the connection you two shared. To be alone is a worse fate. Speaking of worse fates, we gotta figure a way out of here before we end up like those poor bastards. Those poor bastards. Exactly! Huh? What? Look at all those ships. There has to be some parts we can salvage out there. You forget about that internal ocean of stomach acid. You can't just take a little swim. Then get me flying again. I'll see what I can do. I mean, I sure ain't dumb enough to go out there. some engines. That'll do. Listen, I've been running the numbers. We gotta drop weight in order to take off. Drop weight? How exactly do we do that? Yeah, take everything that ain't bolted down and give it the old Chucky Chuck. The lighter we are, the longer we float. The easier it'll be to get airborne. Desperate times, right? When aren't they? Ah! Oh, please don't tell me the answer. Well, I didn't burst into flames. So time for round two. As long as I don't overwork the jets, I should be able to avoid the acid. I hope. Hope this creature doesn't want a midnight snack. Last thing we need is for the acid level to rise. stays with us. But it hardly makes any No, Drax. Rocket, any ideas on how to move these engines? My boots won't be able to. It's an engine, Pete. Just turn it on. Oh, good. A giant red button. This always ends well. Had to put in some elbow grease. Which sounds gross now that I think about it. Careful, Quill. Hey, I'm doing my best out here. Now I'm inside an upset stomach. Hey, Rocket. I want you to go easy on Gamora. Because she's... Yeah, okay. I know when to back off. 
Drax, how's the unloading going? I keep tearing objects off of the bridge, but Rocket says they are essential to life support. Yeah, um, why don't you check with him next time? Sorry, busy. We can talk about this later. Very well, Peter. There's a rhythm to it. Rocket, what's up with these boots? I thought you fixed them. I made a valiant effort. There's only so much you can do when parts are scarce. Incidentally, we're gonna need to replace our plumbing when we get back to nowhere. Either way, stop complaining. Yeah, <sighs> no engines here. Mora. It's a real mess we're in. Everything I touch, I'm toxic. You're not toxic, Gamora. A stomach? <laughs> That's toxic. Thank you. I think. This old stomach is lined with thorium crystals. Like the acid wasn't bad enough already. Rocket. Any luck lightening the ship? Gamora says if I go anywhere near her room, she'll cut off my head. It's a work in progress. What's up, Gamora? Groot never cleaned up his disgusting mess in the bathroom, and he refuses to do it. Maybe Rocket can talk some sense into him? I'll see what I can do. Look at that. With all of those crystals, I can blast us out of here. Or get blown to Kingdom Come. Algo me diz que esses cristais vão ser parte da solução. Rocket, make sure that Groot cleans out the bathroom. Ah, uh, Groot did puke up half his guts after the bar. Should save us some weight to get that barf out of there finally. You know, I'm flying over deadly stomach acid, yet somehow you're the one that grossed me out. Drax. Yes, Peter Quill. Have you gathered the necessary components to eject us from this beast? Not yet. What about now? of Nebula's cyborg parts. No! Empty, of course. Hey, Rocket. Kinda busy, Pete. What's up? Would a piece of thorium work as starship fuel? I suppose so. In a sense, all fuel is just explosion, so... Yeah, it'll explode. Why are you asking? Oh, no reason. Just, <laughs> just curious. Nothing. Nothing. Looks like some kind of filler. Já sei o que eu tenho que fazer. Já sei o que eu tenho que fazer. How's the rest of the crew doing? We are arguing about what to jettison. Get back as quickly as you can. Great. More rocks in my way. Bingo. Eu tenho que fazer esse motor aqui bater nessas pedras ali para eu poder chegar naquele outro motor de lá. Drax, hold up. I, I need to focus on this. Hmm. Don't mind if I do.
Rocket, any luck lightening the ship? Gamora says if I go anywhere near her room, she'll cut off my head. It's a work in progress. Peter, what if we just dispose of Nebula's cyborg parts? No! Coloco o cristal aqui. This doesn't work out. Oof. What a way to go. Easy, big boy. Uh, Peter, I wanted to warn you that I'm throwing away that orange ball you gave me as a token of your affection. The basketball? It hardly weighs a thing. Everything has to go, Peter. And also, Drax stabbed it. Oh, man! <laughs> Rocket, what gives her the mood lately? I ain't got a ton of interest in dying right now. Can you blame me? Bingo. Drax, I know you're dealing with a lot, but so is Gamora. I have heard the news. It is unfortunate. Do you want to talk about Nebula? Nebula knew that we were better off alone. I feel so guilty for what happened to her. Okay. Okay. Just one more to go. Oh crap! Crap, 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 crap! Sounds like progress. 